The cheetah is Africa's fastest land predator known to man. They solely hunt gazelles as their main source of prey. However, it isn't the cheetah's speed that makes it impressive, but its acceleration. The cheetah can go from 0 km an hour to a whopping 96.5 km an hour in just three strides. Aerodynamics and a lightweight frame enables the cat to reach its astonishing acceleration. Thanks to this lightweight frame, the cheetah's muscles don't carry much weight. Along with its compact frame, the cheetah has a small head, flattened ribcage, and slender legs to minimize the cat's air resistance. Once the cheetah reaches top speed, unique bodily design features sustain its speed with a flexible spine, pivoting hips, and shoulder blades that aren't attached to the collarbones. These astonishing features allow its front and rear legs to stretch further apart when fully extended and move closer together when the feet come under its body. This way of running increases its stride length to 25 feet. Now check these little guys out. As seen in the video, the cheetah moves so quickly its feet spend more time in the air than they do on the ground. This means twice in one strand. All four of the cheetah's feet are off the ground at one time. They have a long, muscular tail, hard and flat foot pads like tire treads, and claws that do not completely retract, designed to grip the ground like cleats on a track shoe. This provides the cheetah with more traction for hard, fast turns. However, the cheetah cannot hold its speed, speed for long amounts of time, run for too long, and the whole body cooks, including the brain. This can cause prey to be able to exploit them, specifically gazelles. When animals run, blood warmed by the muscle flows throughout the body. This increases the temperature of every organ, including the brain. However, the gazelle doesn't have the time to waste to wait for the body to cool down with the cheetah hot on its tail resulting in the evolution of the internal system to help the gazelle maintain high speeds for long distances. Even when the body is reaching temperatures as high as 42 degrees Celsius, the brain maintains a steady 40 degrees Celsius. The gazelle does this by cooling warm blood from the heart in an enlarged sinus area before it gets to the brain. It may not be faster than the cheetah, but it can prolong the chase to benefit itself for survival. When the hunt is on, as little as six seconds in, and the cheetah's body and brain have nearly reached breaking point. Twelve seconds in, and the cheetah could be taking a serious risk for its brain, dangerously close to top temperatures. The gazelle begins to run in zigzag formation, prolonging the chase. In 17 seconds, the hunt is over. The cheetah has given up, as it may become critical. The internal system in the gazelle truly helps to outrun the cheetah for the ultimate survival. Until next time guys, stay wild.